Bamboos are bamboos, a bamboo species that flowers once in a human lifetime. As flowered at Vallara and Nagarampara forest stations in Nerimangalam reserve range in eastern Ernakulam. The species of bamboo takes 60 to 130 years to flower. The bamboo is spread over 100 square kilometer between Talkoda and Adimalai in a deciduous forest, which has a variety of flora and fauna that includes a large population of elephants and wild cats. The flowering begin in December. The blooms will last for 3 to 4 months before they dry and die. Such an occurrence had taken place 60 years ago. About bamboo. Bamboos are grasses belonging to the family Garminiae, also called Bohaisiae, the fifth largest flowering plant family. There are around 1200 bamboo species occurring worldwide. India has an abundant bamboo resource including 138 species spread among 24 genera, of which 3 genera are exotic and others are indigenous. Manipur alone has 53 species of bamboo, while Arunachal Pradesh has 50 species. Bamboo uses bamboo shoots and seeds provide food for the people. Bamboo stems and leaves provide forage for livestock. People fashion bamboo into hats, baskets, toys, musical instruments, furniture, chopsticks, paper and weapons. Bamboo stems are used as fuel wood and to build houses, fence tools and field implements. Workers scale bamboo scaffolding to construct the tallest building in Asia. These flimsy looking structures are models of resilience merely spying in typhoons that can collapse steel frameworks. Bamboo flowering Bamboo flowering is a peculiar phenomenon. Bamboos grow vegetatively for a species specific period before flowering, seeding and dying. Most bamboo plants flower only once in their life cycle. Some species of bamboo flower only once every 40 to 50 years. Why bamboo dies after flowering? The two most probable explanations for why bamboo dies after flowering is that seed production requires an enormous amount of energy which stresses the bamboo plant to such an extent that it will actually die. A second explanation could be that the mother plant is creating an optimal environment for its seedlings to survive. In other words, when the mother plant dies, the bamboo seedlings will have full access to water, nutrients and sunlight that would otherwise be used by the mother plant.